Yes, it's open. Sweet. I was kind of worried that it wouldn't be open. Looks like we got the place to ourselves, boys.
Well, I'm gonna go ahead and start dinner now. Um, tonight I'm doing cheeseburgers. It's gonna be pretty simple. Um, cheese, onion, mushrooms. I don't have ketchup or mustard, but so it's gonna be pretty plain. But it's gonna taste good. I got seasoning too, so that's good. Um, the other thing is I did move the truck. I don't know if you guys noticed. Um, I could not get it to like even out over in the spot where I had it. Um, the picnic table isn't right now, it's where I had it parked. I moved it over here. It's just a little bit more flat, more even. So, but I'm gonna go ahead and get dinner going. And uh, oh, by the way, I did find uh, while scavenging for wood, I found this little griddle here. Or this, uh, yeah, this grill top. And I'm gonna use that for my cast iron skillet. So, yeah, I'll go ahead and get that started and uh, get dinner going because I'm getting pretty hungry and it's getting pretty cold. healthy serving of butter some taters of course we got our boigers Well, there she is, folks. Steaming, piping hot. Potatoes. I got uh, double cheese because why not? I toasted the bun. A little bit of uh, uh, sauteed onions and mushrooms. This is going to be a great meal. Here we go, guys. Here we go, guys. Man, that's good. And to wash it all down, nothing fancy, but she'll get the job done. Cheers. Oh, that's perfect. Oh man, I needed that. Forgot to add some crispy lettuce. I had a gentleman stop over and check out my site here a little while ago and he told me about this uh, campsite within walking distance of me with all this wood that just got left behind so score is actually really nice because that little uh, Fisker saw is just no bueno that thing is just not cutting it literally and figuratively
All right, guys, I pretty much got camp set up. I'm gonna show you how I got things going here for the night. So I got, uh, uh, I got my rooftop tent going and some LED rope lights. I'm gonna be running a diesel heater and the bed here has vented and it's gonna be running off my Jackery um, 1000. So uh, should be pretty good. It's got plenty of ventilation in here. Um, keep an eye on it in case it gets hot or something. But yep, I got the the vent running right into the rooftop tent. That's how I got it set up today tonight. I'll probably finish up the night with uh, make some hot uh, chocolate and. Uh, Start getting things uh, cozy up in the rooftop tent because uh, it's pretty cold. So, and I'm tired and it's been a long day and I'm looking forward to actually crawling up in there and rolling up and watching a movie and relaxing. So, but yeah, yeah, I think it's a pretty cool setup.
goodbye little girl. You were super handy. I'm glad I found you. I hope you're here when I come back. Hey guys I'm gonna head out so yeah thank you for watching I hope you liked the video I'm hoping to get some more content out in the next couple of weeks uh, and months as the winter progresses here in Wisconsin and Upper Peninsula I would really like to get up to northern Minnesota sometime I'm just really not familiar with um, the area so I would have to do quite a bit of research but uh, until then I'm gonna try to get up to Upper Peninsula and uh, do some camping and uh, overlanding and dispersed camping. Um, I'd love to get back to High Rock Bay. Uh, I don't know if you remember a year ago, I camped out for two nights at High Rock Bay and that was a pretty sweet experience. So um, I would love to get back up there and uh, especially with snow on the ground because I believe they just got uh, a bunch of snow. So yeah, I'm excited. There's more content coming. Um, if you liked the video, I hope you did. I will never ask you to like or subscribe. I feel like it's a little cringy to, for YouTubers to ask that. So on my channel, I'm never gonna ask you to do that. I just want you to enjoy my videos. So until next time, guys, I'll see you around, stay safe, and I will see you in the next video.